since 2002. We have created excellence, excellence. together. Passion is real. Connection. Connection is real. The ROH experience, experience is real. Welcome to Ring of Honor Wrestling. Honor is real. First time ever dream match. AJ Styles representing Ring of Honor. Kaz Ayashi representing All Japan Ro Pro Wrestling. And, and is Kaz gonna, there's a handshake, the Code of Honor followed by the All Japan Pro Wrestling star. Well, Chris, you said this is a first time meeting. This is a first time singles meeting as they did meet in a tag team match in WCW. And Kaz Ayashi, by the way, is the first person ever to take the Styles Clash. Did you know that? You mean the first time AJ Styles ever hit the Styles Clash? It was on Kaz Ayashi? The first time it was in WCW. Oh, Ray, you really did do your research in this one. That's right. Well, I talked to Kaz earlier before the match. I speak Japanese. Oh, that's a very good skill to have. Okay. As right now, both men filling each other out. AJ going for the arm. What a great match we have. The fans really looking forward to this one and listen to them. You know what? This is definitely a match here that I've been looking forward to because we all know about AJ Styles, what he's done in Ring of Honor. But, you know, Kaz Hayashi, he's one of those fiery wrestlers from Japan. I mean, these two guys can mesh so well together in the professional wrestling ring. I'm really looking forward to this one. All Japan Pro Wrestling hired Hayashi to rebuild their cruiserweight division and he's done just that and AJ Styles of course an MVP in ROH in 2003 so many great matches I mean main event spectacles against Brian Danielson Paul London at Night of the Grudges that three-way at the first anniversary show with Loki and Paul London three legitimate match of the year candidates that I'm all sure that I'm sure all of them are going to settle behind the balloting and don't forget AJ had that run as ROH tag team champions against Amazing Red and who will ever forget those bouts against the Briscoes probably the three best tag team title matches in ROH history. And let's not forget about Kaz Hayashi. When you talk about Cruiserweight Wrestling, this guy has been doing it for about the last decade, starting out in the early 90s in Universal Pro Wrestling. And then he moved to Michinoku Pro, where he wrestled under a mask of Shiro, a member of Kayentai, but not in WWF, but in Japan, he was a member of Kayentai. And we know all about everything he's done in WCW as part of the Young Dragons, but now making a living in Japan as part of All Japan Pro Wrestling. He's definitely a well-traveled well superstar. As he's going to work on AJ Styles right now. Oh, what's this? See, I'm punk back. You know what? Ray, what's that? Since you're going to go, I always seem to be the one leaving. No, you obviously did your research for this one, so guess what? I'm sick of dealing with CM Punk. You can stay. Uh, I'm sure. Hey, Punk, pay attention to the action. I know your mind's going to be on the prophecy thing, but congrats on your win, but just let's pay attention to the action, okay? I I'm out of here. I'm going to go. Uh, shut up. Uh, see you later, Chris. See you later. Hey, uh, CM Punk, uh, Ray Mora, how you doing? Gosh, that guy's a jerk. You know, uh, six months, you know, you've been here and we've never really sat down there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So how about Kaz Hayashi and AJ Styles here in the middle of the ring locking it up? Well, yeah, we've been talking about that, but you seem to be kind of like in a subdued mode, kind of. I, I thought you'd be a little bit more fired up after what we saw happen at the end of that Samoa Joe match. Are you ribbing me? No, I'm not. I mean, I mean what's the deal? I'm crabby all the time, but I'm actually happy. I'm a happy-go-lucky guy. You see, I just found out exactly who took out Lucy. That's why I've been going crazy all this time, because I didn't know who it was. I know, but after now the, the coward, can you, don't don't be like the other guy. Shut up and let me finish. Now the coward's finally stepped forward, and now I know exactly what I have to do. I know who my target is, and I know when and where I'm going to take him out, including Christopher Daniels and the rest of the prophecy. But after the tyrant... Oh, and by the way, uh, excuse me, Ring of Honor 1, All Japan 0? Yeah, that's yeah right. thank you very much. Did that all by myself. You had an impressive showing there. All by myself, thank all by you. by yourself, it was a tag team match with Colt Cabana. Who pinned who? Uh, you pinned Holman. That's right. It was a nice move, Pepsi Plunge off the top. Mm -hmm. You know, looking well for the Japanese press. Yeah, it's great. I, really, I thought it Look at AJ, I know it's coming here. Ooh, well scouted. There you go. Beautiful drop kick by AJ Styles. He just rocked Hayashi. Damn, AJ's one hell of an athlete. Ooh, nice drop kick there, but let's get back to you just a little bit. I thought like, after the tirades you've been on, after the Dayton show on August 9th, that when you found out exactly who was the person that took out Lucy, you would be like on a rampage. 
you're surprising me once again. I was on a rampage to find out who took out Lucy. Now that I know who took out Lucy, it's simple. I get revenge. Me, Colt Cabana, and Ace Steel get revenge on the prophecy. AJ Styles is known to do this, but he hasn't been known to just keep going like that. Yeah, Hayashi, I think, lost him in the crowd. A ton of people here. This is Ring of Honor's largest attendance ever. As AJ just got lost in that massive humanity here in Philly. There he is. Well, I guess, uh, you know, sometimes a dangerous animal is most dangerous when he's quiet waiting to strike. And I guess if I was B.J. Whitmer, I would be very cautious to see him pump. I guess you can call this the calm before the storm. But more importantly, this is the most historic night in Ring of Honor history. And I want to enjoy these matches while giving my expert analysis. And Kaz Hayashi going toe-to-toe -to -toe with AJ Styles right now. AJ getting fired up. You know, these Japan, these Japanese wrestlers came over here looking for a vacation. They came to the wrong place. You're right there as Kaz Hayashi just got rocked. And AJ firing up. You should be used to this. Kind of shades of your match in Baltimore a couple months ago with AJ. What a classic that was. And I love it, I love it as much as Kaz is loving it right now. Ooh. What a form. And yeah. what a kick. And Hayashi's down. I don't think he's even, he was expecting competition quite like this, Pump. I don't think any of them were. They want to win this. But look at Cass. He's standing up to AJ. And he's picking him up. And he drops him with a Bray Buster. And the fans getting behind both these athletes here. This is everything Ring of Honor is about. The fans came here to see wrestling. And they're getting it. And Hayashi now has a headlock slowing it down a little bit. Hey, hey, a, a little piece of information I bet you don't know. What's that? Did you know that Kaz Hayashi was the first person to ever take the Styles Clash? Uh, yeah, we mentioned that a minute ago before you uh, walked in. Shut up. No, seriously, we did. That. Yes, we did. Bro, you didn't know that. I was talking to Kaz earlier. You didn't know earlier. that. Yeah, I, you didn't I, know I, that. I speak a little Japanese. I understand what he was saying. You didn't know that. Hey, yes, I did. No, you didn't. Okay, well, we can rewind the tape later. Me a lot of money to be uh, newsworthy and know what's going on here. They just don't stick anybody here to do the commentary. Well, AJ Styles is fighting out of this headlock, and Kaz boots him in the midsection. AJ Styles, like yourself, has had some experience, and this could be the Styles Clash. Wow, you're right. Kaz Hayashi might might have been scouting AJ Styles there. Well, it might not have been. I don't know. They looked, uh, a lot of the Japanese athletes looked a little bit lax in the locker room. Like they were going to yuck it up and have a good time. And the first two ran right into a brick wall of integrity called the Second City Saints. So I think the rest of them better get their boots on. They better tighten up their laces. You take any Ring of Honor athlete not, and not as serious as you should, and you're going to end up on the wrong, count, wrong side of a three count. You know, I'd have to agree with you there. And, you know, I might not agree with everything that you stand for and the way you practice everything here in Ring of Honor, but I would like to congratulate you. It was an yeah, impressive show. You ever do? Who cares? It was an impressive show tonight. Of course it was. And I had an enjoyable time calling the match as Kaz Hayashi has the upper hand here. And AJ is down. He's in a little bit of trouble here. Now, a lot of the American fans, Ray, yes. might recognize Kaz Hayashi from WCW and the Young Dragons. Yes. I bet, I bet you didn't cover that yet. Uh, yeah, as a matter of fact, I, I, Oh! Nice pile driver there by Hayashi. And Kaz has the upper hand here. AJ's got a, AJ's got a mount a comeback sooner. It could be all over. You think you know everything? Is that it? No, not really. Not quite, but um, I have done my uh, homework. This is a very important show for the rest of us. What's your yourself? IQ? Um, uh, 124, maybe, possibly. I don't know. What's yours? I'm a massive level genius. I'm 138. Oh, okay. Okay. And Kaz Hayashi has, looks like he's smothering AJ there. AJ, if he's winded, he's going to be in a lot more trouble here. And the crowd behind. AJ Styles and probably Kaz Hayashi here, a very respectful audience here. 100 strong behind wrestling, period. I don't think it, may, I don't think it matters who comes through that curtain the rest of the night. And Kaz has AJ hooked again. Is he going for another pile driver? Punk, if he hits another pile driver, it could be it. And I think AJ is very aware of that. And AJ goes for a lariat but misses. And he has him. 
nice variation of a backbreaker, almost going around the body of AJ Styles. Almost a two in a world backbreaker maneuver right there. Kazayashi got caught. And he looks like he's in a lot of pain on the mat, Punk. And only, most of the time, it only takes one maneuver like that to take the wind out of the guy. And AJ. Great kick right to the face. I mean, you wrestled AJ Styles before, but he seems a little bit more intense tonight. Do you he's see a, that? He's a very intense individual. But yeah, there's a lot on the table this night. Like I, I stated before, the Japanese media. The right. press, everybody out there taking your picture. Yeah, I mentioned that a little bit earlier during your match there that, you know, it's important for your guys, to, you know, the Americans to get over, but it's, I think, almost doubly important for the Japanese wrestlers to get over in America. The Japanese don't want to go home losers, and we certainly don't want to lose on our own turf. So there's a lot of pr a pride on the line. A lot of competition on the line, and that's what you got to love, and that's what Ring of Honor brings to the table. And that's exactly why this place is so electric right now. AJ Styles looks to be tying up Kaz in a bow and arrow. Miyamoto at ringside, person that you defeated earlier on tonight. And he has him in a bow and arrow here. He could get a submission. He's got a grip right under the chin. Hayashi got to roll a bit more to get to the ropes. But no, goes through. And referee out of position on that one. It's a pretty, pretty strong kick there by AJ Styles as he's following up with some forearms. Yeah, if Kaz Hayashi was looking for a vacation, he went to the wrong place, I'll tell you that. Exactly. I think a lot of the other All Japan superstars are maybe watching this at ringside or in the back, and they're uh, they're rethinking their strategy, let me say. Ooh, drop toe holds AJ right across the throat on the rope. AJ got caught right there. What's Kaz going for? And a nice DDT as he just planted AJ's head into the mat. Could this be it? No, two count. Not pretty, but very effective. I'll tell you what, if I was Satoshi Kojima, and I was looking at the competition that's going on in this match and the prior match with yourself, I'd be rethinking my strategy because you know Homicide, he's fired up for that match tonight. Homicide, uh, obviously, uh, almost the MVP of Ring of Honor, besides myself. Of course, gut buster by AJ Styles. And another backbreaker variation right there. Kaz Hayashi's lower back, he's gonna be waking up feeling pretty sore tomorrow morning on his plane ride to wherever he's going. I think that would be Japan, Ray. Scores, but AJ, AJ got clothesline out of his boots also. And both guys are rocked on the mat. And referee Gary Moriera with going for a 10 count here. I, I can't, while both wrestlers are down, let me let me take a moment. I can't get over how ugly some of these photographers are. Ooh, what do you have with the photographers? What I have this? nothing with the photographers. I can't tell which one, male or female. What does this have to do with anything? We have an important match here. Is that Stevie Nicks or Vince Neal? I don't right know. To the left, right to the left of Hayat. Who is that? Who's that? I that's, can't that's tell. That's Charlie from Yamax. He representing All Japan Wrestling right there. Down with Charlie. I know who Charlie is. I was talking about the man he, she. What is your problem? Let's get to the match. And it looks Most like we could have a Styles Clash. Hayashi blocks and hits the runner. Tight cover. AJ barely kicks out at two. Wow, Kaz Hayashi's showing me a lot here. And what's he going for, Punk? Do you know? Uh, he's signaling for something. This man is so dangerous on so many levels. And he's just stalking AJ Styles. What's he going for? He's going for a go behind, maybe a dragon suplex. But AJ drops down. Kaz hooks him. Counter after counter, we got a cross face on. AJ smartly rolls through. AJ quickly rolls through. Could go for that dragon. And he hits it. This could be it. But no, AJ fights out of it. Kaz has got to capitalize. Go Kaz for is, another cross face. Excuse me, Punk. Kaz has used that many, many times to put people away. And he could put away AJ Styles right here. Quaking on the neck of AJ. Look at AJ's hand is trapped behind him. 
And AJ desperately needs to get to the ropes. Look at that angle. Purse's neck is not supposed to bend like that. AJ's hand is in the air, ready to tap. His feet makes the ropes. Thankfully, he makes the ropes, so that could have been it. But how much damage was done to the neck of AJ Styles? There's a lot of weight on Cass Hayashi's shoulders right now. His company's already down. It's one nothing Ring of Honor. If he doesn't win this, and Kaz going to the top rope. He's one of the top cruiserweights in the world, but he just got caught by AJ. He's set right up for a Styles clash. You're right, he's got him. But no, Kaz rolls through. AJ rolls through. And look, he's got him. Styles clash. That's all she wrote. Ring of Honor 2, All Japan, nothing. And that's it.